What's up guys, it's your girl Ray here and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, welcome to the lovely family. It is finally December and I am super excited. December is the greatest month of the year. I love it so much. I always have and I always will and I am not just saying that because it's my birth month but it is also the birth month of Jesus Christ. Winter all around is my favorite season to decorate. It's very like warm and cozy in a sense where it's like it's cold outside but it's cuddly weather inside you know and I'm such a hopeless romantic so I just love 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 the month of December. I have a lot of videos coming this month because it's my favorite month. I have a lot of looks that I want to show you guys that I want to create and all that jazz. So today's look, I want to do a festive look, but I want it to be like a soft glam. Cause you know, you have your glam glam, your powwow, then you have your day glam and your night glam and oh geez. And then you have, you know, I want, I want a soft glam to where it's like a little bit harder than day glam, like a Christmas party glam, but like with your family because y'all are going to have dinner, not like a Christmas party glam where you're with your friends wearing your ugly Christmas sweaters and doing, what is it called, White Santa or something like that. So per usual, I'm going to start off with my eyes. So the first thing I need to do is take my glasses off. Um, and I'm also going to pull my hair back. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm taking my spoolie just to uh, comb my eyebrow hairs upwards. I don't know why, but like I just like combing them upwards before I start like applying my concealer and everything. So I'm just going to do that. I like don't do it for a specific reason. I just like to do it. Now I'm taking my Morphe M124 flat brush with my concealer. And I'm going to use this to carve out my eyebrows. So now that my eyelids are primed, I'm going into my Makeup Revolution Reloaded Marvelous Mattes Palette. And I am taking the shade number four, which is this deep red right here. And on my Morphe M433, I'm just going to pack that shade onto the outer V, but more towards the crease area. And I'm going to use this instead of blending it out. I'm going to first shape it the way I want it. Here, I'm going to zoom y'all in a little bit so that y'all can see exactly what I'm doing. And with a different blending brush, I'm going into the same palette and I'm going to take this orange shade right here which is directly next to the red that I just used so I'm going to use shade number three and I'm just going to lightly pack this shade into the rest of my crease and a little bit over top of that red And now I'm going to start to blend some of that red over. And now I'm going down into the shade number 14, which is this white shade down here. 
and I'm taking a flat brush and I'm gonna take this shade and pack it all over the rest of my lid. And this look definitely needs some eyelashes. So the eyelashes I'm going to be using are my Mink 3D lashes that I got from the dollar store, I think. Or no, my mom got these, but I think she got these from a beauty supply. So, but before I apply the lash, I'm going to do the other eye and then I'll be right back. All right guys, so I did my other eye. I put my lashes on and while I was doing my other eye, I was watching the clip back and I realized I didn't tell y'all what eyeliner I was using, but I was using my Sephora felted wink it my felted. My I was using my Sephora felt tip wink it eyeliner. That's the eyeliner that I use to give myself a little wing. I have my eyelashes on. So now it's time to get into this skin, honey. And to prime, I'm using my least favorite primer, which is the Sephora Beauty Amplifier. I've had this for a very long time. I need to get rid of it. But um, it is a shimmery primer. It is a glowy primer. And for the look that we're going for today, I want that glow underneath from underneath so even if it is a soft glow so I'm just gonna put a little bit of that on my face while I give that a chance to set I know y'all are probably sick of looking at my eyebrows like this I'm just gonna go ahead and fix those really quickly There you go. Now since this is such a subtle glam, I am going with my e.l.f. I'm going with my e.l.f. Flawless Finish Foundation in the color Mocha. And to set that concealer, I'm going in with my Makeup Revolution powder in the Tint Terracotta. And 
ready to set the rest of my face, I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the tint Dark. And now I'm going to take my Black Radiance Press Powder and I'm going to use that to bronze. And to set my face, I'm using my Morphe Continuous I'm using my Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Now I'm going to use my Sephora <clears throat> Illuminizing palette, not illuminate. I'm gonna use my Sephora Illuminizing palette in my normal gold down here in the middle, and I'm gonna use that to set, not set, to highlight my cheeks. I'm also going to do my nose, or the tip of my nose, and the little dent right here, naturally the forehead. And I'm looking this way because there's a mirror, a bigger mirror, so. And a little bit on the chin. So really quickly, I'm going to go back to the eyes and I'm just going to put that red underneath on my lower lash line. For my waterline, I'm taking my Essence Eyeliner Pencil. For my lashes, I'm using my I Love Extreme Crazy Volume Mascara, also by Essence. And for my lips, I'm taking my NYX Lip Pencil in the color Espresso to Line. And next, I'm going to take my ColourPop Lipstick in the color Beeper. And that is all I have for you guys today. I hope that you like this look. Let me know if you recreate it. Let me know what kind of festive looks you would like to see and that you are going to try out. And I'll see if I can recreate them or whatever, you know? And until then, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.